Hello friends, one and only Incurably Crafty Orm is back. Uh, today we're going back to, uh, to long range pieces. I've been working on a few different ones, so I'm kind of excited to show you guys what I've been doing lately. Um, today's piece is a marble gun. Just a little bolt action marble launcher. Kind of fun, kind of cute. Entirely spring powered, super, super simple. It's all scrap wood, and these poles are from um, one of them drying racks that you can fold together and all the poles slide into each other and stuff. So it was perfect to make something that required sort of a piston action because I already had all these hollow pipes that slide through each other intentionally. Um, goes together super, super simple. Uh, I got the sun working against me a little bit coming through my skylight up there. But um, as you can see, just this little pin right here goes through. This end is a screw. This end is smooth, so I don't jack up my fingers too much. Um, and then this ratchet head is mostly just uh, so the spring doesn't end up going up and around this tube here because they're really close in size. It was working well for a while, but like third or fourth shot in, it just bounced too much. And then this... That's a bolt there with a smooth end, and then the threaded end is inside of here. Um, so the spring will slide down the smooth end, everything squeezes in together, and then you just let go. Um, at the end of this tube, though, you won't be able to see it inside. Maybe you will, maybe we'll get a little lucky. Let's see. Okay, yeah, you can see it. Um, these all have like plastic ends. They're like connector ends and they're meant, there's a nut inside of them. They're meant to put a screw in. So I put the screw all the way in. So the screw head is what's going to be hitting the marble, not this, uh, hollow tube itself. It's important when you're using a marble or something like that as your ammunition. And all you're doing is uh, clap launch like that, that whatever you're hitting it with is something incredibly solid because it's that shock, that reverb, um, the impact of those two solid and round smooth objects colliding that's what's going to launch the marble um because this doesn't operate on air pressure at all like how a um how a bb gun works where it builds up air in a chamber and it's the air being pushed forward that launches the bb um this doesn't work like that this is supposed to just be a toy i wasn't trying to make anything that could break a window or hurt somebody still you know playing around with it safety glasses it's better safe than sorry, but that's about all you should need. Um, I took a shot to the chest with this thing and my daughter just to test it out and see if it worked and it didn't hurt at all. So, um, we're going to give this bad boy a shot and, uh, that'll be it. So what I have here is this little plastic green marble and I'm using a plastic one. Um, the glass ones are a little too big and... Oh, apparently that's going to be a little too big, too. Uh-oh. Hmm, that's weird. The blue ones I was using yesterday fit perfectly. Okay, so we don't want it wedged in there because this it tapers off down here. Um, actually, I put that pink rubber band on there to kind of look cool, but I'll take that right off. That piece tapers in a little bit. So we don't want something that's going to wedge down in there because then what's going to happen is it's going to launch up. It's going to hit that edge. It's going to just bounce right back. It's not going to fire out at all. So give me just one second here. Maybe I can find a bead or something. Let's see. Let's see. Yep. That'll work. No, no. There we go. So instead we're using a little crafting bead. It's kind of hard to see. That little sucker. Oop. I'm going to drop it. So, right in the barrel. Very easy. And I kept this thing nice and short for me. Just kind of hold it like that. Right hand, because I'm right handed. Do my best to. Yeah, bead didn't go very far. Um, I want to try the little steel uh, bearings I use for slingshots. Um, I feel like that would be 
pretty effective, but again, um, less is more for this. Um, you know, just for fun's sake, see if it'll shoot a pencil. Let's give this a try. Just out of curiosity. Well, I have you here. Meh. Went a little farther than the bead, but yeah, it's definitely a round projectile kind of thing. It's a little fun. Uh, had this spring piece for a while. I've been putting it in and out of a bunch of different projects. Some of them work, some of them don't. But that's my marble gun. Thanks, guys. Like always, like ratings are appreciated, but even more appreciated are your opinions. So feel free to leave your comments in the comment section down below. Anything you want to see me work on, questions, comments, uh, just I'm gonna shoot the breeze. Um, so yeah, thanks for indulging me. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.